and little tiny dwarf puppers. These things are so small. That is Delilah and Dolores. See, that one just ate, that one just ate. What's up guys, welcome back to another video. We got a special one for you guys today. You guys have always been asking us to get some little micro fish, so we're finally gonna do it. But before we hop into it, just wanted to mention this giveaway of the Marine Land five gallon tank right here. We're doing a giveaway on this at 50K subscribers. You guys have been awesome. So in order to enter, you guys gotta be a subscriber, so go down and smash that subscribe button. You gotta leave a comment on this video, and we're gonna be announcing it on Instagram, so you gotta go give us a follow on Instagram, and boom, you will be entered into the giveaway. This is a great tank, you're not gonna wanna miss it. But, let's hop right into the video, and uh, I'll show you what we got. All right guys, we are back once again, once again at Barrier, and we are Looking for more fish for our freshwater tank. We love that tank. I think it's awesome. We love how the setup is going, okay? And a couple things caught my eye the other day. These little guys right here, little puffers, man. Little tiny dwarf puffers. These things are so small, but they are so freaking cute, and I love them, and we're getting them 100%. So we're going to get all three of these guys probably. We're getting all three. And then, oh, look, a little red tail down here. I would definitely get that in a tank, but you know, we can't because we'll eat everything, but I'm thinking all three of these guys for sure. I love the those, and look at this flower horn right here. If we had another tank, I would definitely buy you. He's aggressive already. Look at this. Yep, just like Arnold. Just, obviously doesn't have a huge head like Arnold, but still very aggressive. Maybe we'll get a couple of guppies. Look at all these guppies over here. So, we got options, guys. Keep commenting down below what fish you guys want to see in our tank. These puffers are gonna be the star of the show by far. Um, they're cool as hell. I love them, so we're gonna wrap all three up, bring them back to the house, and see how they look in the tank. Someone just bought the flower horn? No, good. someone just bought the flower horn. All right, good for them, they bought the flower horn. But um, yeah, so we're gonna grab these pea puffers, and I just wanted to show you guys if you guys think this would be cool to get in our tank. Right there, one of those knife fish back there. Those things are wild to me. I think they're super weird and cool. There's actually two in here. One's actually above behind the filter, but that little that little guy, the top one's bigger, that little guy right there. I think that'd be really cool to have in the tank. So that could be a cool addition. You never know. I can, this pretty bad glare. You can't, right there. There you can see him good. Right there in the back. That's a pretty cool fish. I wouldn't mind getting one of those. And they actually got a big shipment in, so they have a lot of fish. But he's wild to me right there too. I'm gonna zoom in for this for you guys. I've never seen a fish like that before. I don't know what that is. That thing is weird looking. So, yeah, we got options. We definitely got options for this tank. Let's see what else we got here. We got, um, oh, this guy right here, albino bite shirt. That thing is so cool. It kind of looks like one of those little albino salamander things with the arms and stuff. Those things are cool, nothing down here. But uh, yeah, check this guy out right here. That thing is so cool. I like him a lot. Nice slide. That was good. Perfect. <laughs> Sound effects. <laughs> All right, guys. Boom. We got our two fish here. We got our beautiful pea. Actually, three fish. We got our two little microscopic baby pea puffers. You can barely see them. They're the cutest things I've ever seen in my life. I love them. So we talked to Barry about them. We actually keep calling them pea puffers, but they're actually not pea puffers. They're totally different. They're not pea puffers at all. They are like. I think I said BB puffers, okay? They're not pea puffers. Pea puffers, you need brackish water. Is that check? Pea puffers, you need brackish water. We asked Barry about these guys. You don't need brackish water. They're good with straight fresh. And then we got our little loach here. What is the kind of loach is this? Pakistan. Pakistan loach. I think. Boom. We got him. He's just sitting on the bottom right there. So we're going to acclimate these guys first. And then we'll put them in. Let's do it. They've been acclimating for about 15, 20. And uh, we're gonna let the pea puffers keep acclimating while I put the loach in. He's gonna be first, and then we're gonna do the cute little pea puffers, okay? Here we go with our Pakistani loach. I'm gonna dump him out into the net here. There he is, in the net. Hey, little buddy. Look at him, he's like a tiger, he's like a tiger shovel nose. Guys, look at him right there. He looks like a little tiger shovel nose catfish right there. A little crazy guy. Here he goes, in the tank. Swim the other way, man. The other way, buddy. Just look at him, goes right down to the bottom. Him and Jimbo, you guys are friends now, huh? Okay. We're probably not gonna see him for a while. He's just gonna hide in the back. He's in the back. Behind the plants already. Goodbye. What's his name? Comment down below what his name is. I'm thinking Tiger. 
because he looks like a tiger. Now, to the cutest things I've ever seen, Loki puppers. Let's do it. I'm gonna need your expertise for again, bro, with your net holding. And we're doing them both at the same time. These are, look at them. You can see them darting around there. So cute! My God. I love pea puffers. They're not, they're not even pea puffers. Why do you keep calling them that? They're BB puffers. All right, here we go. Are they going yet? There they are. Look at those little guys. Hey, little buddies. That is Delilah and Dolores. Boom. Oh my God, they're that so freaking cool, dude. Oh my God, they're so cool. They're so cool. They're so cool. I love them so much. I hope they stay together. Stay together. No, don't go away from each other. Stay together. Guys, comment down below what fish you guys want to see in this tank. I think it's coming along great. Look at these cute little puppers and our little guy. Look at he's starting. He's starting around. Oh my god, they're so cool. I love the pea puppers. They're by far my favorite. Dolores and what did I say? Delilah. Delilah. Okay, love them both. They're beautiful. We got Jimbo and we got Tiger. Coming along great. All right, guys, another thing I wanted to do today is put our invisible fish over here into that tank is this tank why why not just put it in you know so we're gonna grab them out here turn the light on as you guys can see them they're doing great in here they're eating like crazy there they are right there and the other guys on the top left so we're gonna put these guys in that tank so we're gonna have a blind fish and invisible fish pretty crazy okay let's do it oh and i forgot that these guys are like literally nascar racing fish they're so fast i gotta get aggressive i gotta get there we go boys there's our first one right here. Run them over. Go. There he goes. <laughs> there he goes. There we go. I got him in the net. So. All right, let's go. Put him over. Oh, okay. the Boom. There we go. They're going to have a nice home in here. Much bigger than the other one. All right, so this is about a week later, guys. I know I'm in another shirt, okay? I know you guys, you guys can handle it. I'm changing shirts a lot this video. So we film this over multiple days. But as you can see, we got our goldfish in there from our Easter egg video. We got Jimbo doing strong and our two pea puppers now. And the invisible fish. Yeah, they're in here somewhere and they're really hard to see. But they, are, they love it in here. They've been doing so well in here. And they eat like crazy. So I defrosted some blood worms here. They're in this cup right there. Defrosted some blood worms. The, the puffers absolutely love them. They grow up. It takes them a little while to find them, but they absolutely love them and they're eating and they're healthy. And the, the invisible fish, they eat like red tailed catfish. They eat everything. So I'm going to pour these guys in here and see who's going to eat. Just pour a little bit at a time. See, look, the goldfish is already eating. He's already crazy. And that thing is going to get big. And once it's bigger, <laughs> we're going to put him in a new tank accordingly. But Keep an eye on the pea puffers. There, there's one in the back there. He's gonna eat, he's gonna eat, he's gonna eat. There's, no, they're both there, they're both there. Oh, see, that one just ate, that one just ate. That little guy, I'm gonna pour the rest in because I want them to really smell it here. Just get them all flowing. Look, look, he's about to eat, he's about to eat. Yes, dude, yes. If that isn't the freaking cutest fish you've ever seen in your life, I don't know what is. Honestly, yes. So I just poured a lot of blood worms in here to let everything eat. Even their invisible fish right there, grubbing. The goldfish grubs a lot. And of course, the puffers. These, those are my favorite, those are my babies. I, I, I wanna keep them healthy, but I love those fish. They're hilarious. And I'm thinking about getting a lot more. I'm thinking to get like three more in here. It'd be super cool, just have a bunch of little baby puffers. So as you can see, the goldfish, he loves to eat. He'll eat anything. And the loach is in here somewhere. He likes to hide in the plants. I barely really see him. So that's kind of, I thought he'd be out more, but he hides in the plants. Maybe we'll get some more loaches so we can actually see him every once in a while. But as you can see, everything in here is doing good and is healthy. And let us know down in the comments what other fish you would like in here. I love the little cute little pea puffers. So is there any other fish like that that we can get? Let us know down in the comments and uh, we'll read all your guys' suggestions. And we'll pick one out of all you guys and get your fish. All right, so leave some, leave some, leave some suggestions down in the comments and let us know. I love this guy. <laughs> that's my that's my son right here. My son. Alright guys, so that is gonna be it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed this tank. This tank's coming along very well. And don't forget to enter the giveaway right here 
50K is coming up close. We wanted to give you guys a long, a nice couple weeks to uh, enter into this giveaway before it actually raffled off. So remember guys, we're gonna be announcing this winner on Instagram. So remember to go give us a follow on there and uh, check us out. So that is it for today's video guys. I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.